The number of asylum seekers in Las Cruces keeps going up. Let's take a look at the latest numbers. According to Las Cruces, the number of migrants they've received in the last few weeks is now up to about 2,100. On Wednesday alone, they received 118. The city also says that 189 migrants left the city yesterday, with 90 of those taken to El Calvario and the Annunciation House here in El Paso. According to Las Cruces, 80 more asylum seekers were dropped off this morning, all of which were then transported to the Annunciation House. For the second time this month, the city of Las Cruces has made adjustments to its budget to accommodate the hundreds of migrants arriving on a daily basis. KTS 79 News reporter Selena Quintana is in Las Cruces with exactly how much money we're talking about. That's right, City Council just approved a $500,000 budget that will help aid all expenses when it comes to immigrants and refugee assistance. Just announced in Thursday's meeting, the city is also leasing a former U.S. Army Reserve training center to house migrants. Mayor Miyagashima says this is a step closer to moving forward with long-term plans. But we also need to make sure that we have to, uh, plans for both uh, not just short-term, mid-term, but long-range plans, and that's also what we're looking to do here as well uh, by leasing the old armory on Brown Road. Uh, this is an armory, a facility that's used to housing 150 people. The city says they recognize the large influx of migrants, and this is just one way they're preparing for those numbers to increase. Reporting in the City Hall of Las Cruces, Selena Quintana, KTSM 9 News.